Lynx coach Cheryl Reeve confronts Sun players over post-game celebration, sources reveal tense moment in a heated moment following Game 1 of the WNBA semifinals, Minnesota Lynx head coach Cheryl Reeve took issue with the Connecticut Sun's post-game celebration, leading to a confrontation near the locker rooms. According to sources close to the situation, Reeve, a four-time WNBA Coach of the Year, expressed her displeasure with how the Suns celebrated their narrow victory over the Lynx. Reeve, known for her fiery competitive spirit, reportedly approached several Connecticut players as they walked toward their locker room at the Target Center in Minneapolis. As one source put it, Reeve ran up on the Sun players, causing enough tension that arena security had to step in to defuse the situation. The WNBA has yet to comment on the altercation, although the league is said to be aware of the incident, after Minnesota's Game 3 victory, Reeve was asked about the confrontation. While she didn't delve into details, her response hinted at the intense emotions running high in the playoffs. It's like the players always say, there are really competitive people, Reeve remarked. Really competitive people. It's the playoffs. Sun head coach Stephanie White, who wasn't present during the altercation, brushed off the situation when asked for a comment a week later. That was a week ago, White said, showing no interest in revisiting the incident. I don't have any comment on that. The drama unfolded after a nail-biting finish to Game 1, where the Lynx came within one possession of forcing overtime. Minnesota star player Nafisa Collier missed a potential game-tying three-pointer with only a second left on the clock, sealing Connecticut's win. Sun forward Alyssa Thomas, who came just one assist shy of a triple-double, celebrated emphatically, flexing and marching toward her team's bench of this intense celebration seems to be the moment that rubbed Reeve the wrong way. Thomas had finished the game with 17 points, 10 rebounds, and 9 assists, helping the Sun secure a hard-fought victory. We had to be disruptive, White said after the win, praising her team's defensive effort, the tension between these two teams is not new, with their regular season matchups being decided by razor-thin margins. The chippiness carried over into Game 2, where Sun guard Marina Mabry and Lynx players clashed multiple times. At one point, Mabry collided with Minnesota's Bridget Carlton and later dove for a loose ball, landing on Nafisa Collier. Lynx forward Maisha Heinz Allen intervened, pushing Mabry away, further stoking the rivalry. Despite the tension, Reeves Lynx fought back, winning Game 2 and evening the series before taking a 2 1 lead with a 90 81 victory in Game 3. Reeve noted the physicality of the series after Game 2, saying, when you play these guys, you have to be physically and mentally tough, because they sure are. As the Lynx and Sun prepare for Game 4, all eyes are on the intense competition and the possibility of more fireworks both on and off the court.